Good morning, friends. We are gonna do an unboxing of the Simply O3 Ozone Generator. This is one of my favorite technologies to have in home. It's incredibly powerful and effective. And I wanna show you how easy it is to use, how easy it is to set up so you can do this modality from the comfort of your own bathroom. Let's open the system. Here we are, we're here with our Simply O3 Ozone System. We're gonna unbox this live. Beautiful packaging, by the way. Simply O3, you did a great job. Simply O3, here's our administration kit. So this is gonna be like our catheters. When we talked about rectal encephalation or doing ozone in your butt, different syringes. Here's our side kit. We have some supplements like ozone capsules and some ozonated olive oil. So nice to have in the cupboard at home. We have our stethoscope. So this is where we can use ozone in the ears. I'll actually show you this. And here is, this looks like, here is our Stratus 3.0 ozone generator. This is what makes the magic when we apply electricity to oxygen. Let's set this to the side. What else do we have? This is our, this looks like the pediatric regulator. Boom, this is gonna control oxygen flow from the tank. Our last but not least, we have our water bubbler to pair with the system. This is gonna allow us to do ozonated water to optimize gut health. Very exciting, so box number one is done. And this looks like, to me, our oxygen source. So we got a pre-filled oxygen tank here, and this is gonna be outfitted with the pediatric regulator, and we're open, let's set this thing up. Here we go. Let's open this Stratus 3.0 ozone generator. Here we go. Here is our operator's manual, which we will be sure to read. I, I, this is my favorite thing to offer human beings when we invest in technology. You are going to get the most out of it when you read the directions. There's also some great educational resources online at Simply the Three. So we'll set that to the side here. And oh my goodness, this is so beautiful. So you can see everything's been laid in foam. This is a box that I would recommend keeping for future travel. Um, here is our power supply. Here is some of our tubing. And here is our Strauss 3.0 ozone generator. And this is gonna be pretty easy to set up. So we're back. We're back and I've got everything unboxed. We did a walkthrough. What is included in your Simply O3 kit? Um, we are working with the Stratus 3.0 generator. I have to say, when I open any technology, I'm always intimidated. And I've worked with Ozone for a long time, but Simply O3 has made this incredibly easy. And I wanna say, disclaimer, I am not a medical doctor, I'm not a health professional. Simply O3 provides excellent educational videos, which you have to watch. And friends, you gotta use the manual. I promise you it'll help you. That being said, I could put this together in about two minutes and I'm gonna show you how. So the first thing that we did, we took our tank and we attached the pediatric regulator here. And I simply tightened this bolt with my hands and I did about one quarter turn with a wrench just to make sure it's tightened. Now, when I turn on my oxygen tank, I'm gonna be sure that my Simply O3 regulator is set to zero. That means no oxygen is flowing and I can open the tank and I'm not gonna hear any sound or hissing. I know I've got a secure connection. The next thing I'm gonna do, so I'll turn that off for now, right? We'll leave that alone. And when you do turn it on, you'll notice, uh, you'll notice the needle on the pressure valve jumps up a little bit that you've got oxygen in the tank. So I'm gonna go ahead and connect this tubing to my little hose down here, little nodule. And that is connection number one. Again, refer to the training and setup videos. This is just Freddie walking you through this from my home. Um, connection number two is going to go to the O2 inlet. It's marked here on the side, O2 inlet tube to the side of the device. Easy breezy. And friends, you're connected. There's a power outlet on the back that I did not show you, but if you can't figure out the power inlet, we're in a lot of trouble that ozone will not fix for you. I love you. Um, here's our system, right? We're ready to turn it on. So I'm gonna turn on the oxygen and then I'm gonna turn on my flow rate. 
So I'm gonna go one, two, three, four, five, and then I'm gonna push power on my machine. So how do I know that anything's happening? Well, number one, I can take this 60 milliliter syringe and I can connect it to the lure lock. This, I could use this for nasal and suffocation, but that's not the point. I wanna show you that ozone is filling. So when I attach it to the unit here, I will start to see that I'm getting ozone, right? We're gonna fill that all the way up. And then I would simply disconnect this. Always be careful, uh, don't breathe in ozone gas. But I can, I can smell from the scent that it's creating that this machine is working right now. Now, the flow rate, there's a chart, handy chart in the manual, that's gonna tell you how much gamma or how strong the ozone gas is. We're just gonna like discard that and blow it away. I'm just gonna keep going here. So let's do this. Let's power this off for a second. And now let's connect the bubbler. So the bubbler is something we're gonna use to ozonate water. The benefits of ozonated water, I'm gonna let Simply O3 stick to, but this is a cool application. Now you'll notice here, there is a, a separate instruction manual, which I set to the side, which shows you how to set up this bubbler. There is a backflow that is gonna stop any water from flowing back into your ozone machine. That is something you definitely wanna avoid. But same connection, there's a lure lock on the front of the device. Oops, I turned that on and turn that off. And I'll connect that. And because I left the oxygen on, because it's on a flow rate of, let's see here, we'll do a, we'll do a five, which we can actually go to our chart right here. And a five is gonna tell us how much gamma. So it's roughly 32 gamma. Um, that is um, the milliliters or how intense the ozone in is again. But you can see when we connect this device right away, I have air flowing through the system. Now I haven't turned the unit on. Now I can hear the fan start to move. There is a tube in there with electricity happening. This is a modern miracle of science, but we're making ozone gas at this time. And one way I could tell you is that if I were to take this tube, which is, has the off gassing of the ozone being bubbled through, there's some ozone, I can smell that. If I bubble this, I'm gonna wanna run it at, I think it's about one quarter liters per minute for 12 minutes is gonna ozonate this water to have it be effective for ozone for wellness. Um, when I do that, I'm gonna connect this Simply O3. This is called the Destruct. And what this is gonna do, it's gonna catch any of the ozone gas vaporizing into the room, whatever the word is I wanna use there. But I'll just connect that and that's gonna catch any of the ozone smell. I imagine there's some volcanic ash or charcoal in here that's gonna do a good job at serving that need. So there's our system, friends. We're all set up. Our gas is running. We've set our flow rate or our strength or the gamma, how strong we want it. And here is our bubbled water. Now, let me just show you, cause I showed you how to fill the 60 cc syringe. We'll just do this all in one take. How I would use the stethoscope. So if I wanna use a little ozone gas, which has been bubbled for brain health, or if I had an ear infection, I would use this stethoscope. Now, I love what they've done here with the system. It's very easy to use. And what this does is creates accessibility, right? Um, anybody can do this at home. I would simply take off the destruct. I would undo this lure lock here. Be very careful. You always wanna be careful around the glass, right? Glass is, this is a beautifully hand-blown unit. Um, and they, they do have notes about that in the manual, but I always wanna be careful. Sidebar. Don't throw away your boxes that came with the Simply O3 system. Um, the Stratus, if you wanna if you wanna mail this or ship it anywhere, you're gonna need the boxes which have the, the protective foam padding and the nice cutout. So I'll connect the lure lock here. And then that is ready to go. I'm ready to use the stethoscope as an applicator. So I could sit and watch Netflix. I could do a little um, a therapeutic modality here. And what you'll notice is I can hear the sound of oxygen ozone coming through this bubbler. But what I can also feel is a gentle warming in the ears, um, 10 minutes, 15 minutes, however long you want to look. Again, always refer, defer to not the doctor, just the advocate for health here, how you're going to use the system for your body. So that was like application number two. And that one's like pretty good to go. I want to show you one more thing. We'll stop this. We're going to turn off our oxygen. We'll set this back to zero. 
If I had a pro tip for you from many years of ozone, especially if you're going through Lyme or mold or chronic illness, people leave their tank on and they come back to do another session and the tank is clean. It's so annoying and you gotta get it filled again. So don't do that. <laughs> Stop it. Stop it. S-T-O-P, new word, I-T. So I'm gonna undo this lure lock, great. And now I'm set up to fill we talked about this on the podcast, my, my ozone bag. And the great thing about ozone bags is you can do rectal encephalation and this guy becomes portable. It's gonna hold the ozone. And we have also a nice little catheter. This goes in your butt. And it makes it very easy to go into the bathroom, do your thing, do your therapy, and then the light is green, the trap is clean. That's a Ghostbusters reference. All the 80s movies here. Again, same setup, right? Lure lock connects to the front of the plate. My bag is all set up. It's ready to receive ozone. Again, we can see this flow chart here. That's is where I'm gonna do a little research. What kind of gamma do I wanna use? How strong in my body? And you can see the bag here is marked very clearly with 200 milliliters, 400 milliliters, and 750 milliliters. These bags provide a standard in which you can dose yourself and not be guessing. Um, historically, I would just put the tube in my butt right from the machine. Don't do that. Maybe you want to have a little science and a little more systematic approach to your health. So enough talking. We're going to turn on the glass, right? We're going to set the flow rate. We'll put this to five. Five is 32 gamma, or we can even go down to four. We could go to 23 gamma, however you want to do it. Six is 53 gamma. Again, refer to your flow chart and refer to a medical professional. I'll turn this on. And all of a sudden what's happening here now, to be fair, I let the oxygen run for a second, but you'll start to see this bag fill over time. And the first one you'll see is this compartment that is marked 200 milliliters. So you can start really, really slow with your first rectal and ozone encephalation, which we should do a video on. Um, not in the bathroom, but it could be fun just to kind of walk through this one modality and how I use this at home. Again, team, you can see I basically set this up in a few minutes. It's very easy to use. There's great training videos. The packaging and the system is beautiful. And this is a great wellness technology to have from the comfort of your home. It's gonna last forever, and you're gonna put your wellness back in your own hands. Freddie from the Beautifully Broken Podcast, thank you, Simply03. Your team is amazing, and what you're doing in the world is incredible. Big love.